have sworn that I was walking into a Starbucks. Hi, welcome to heaven. Is that like a new coffee shop? No, you died and you're in heaven now. Okay, where are the cameras? I'm being pranked, right? It's not a prank. You dropped your phone going into Starbucks and then an elderly woman ran you over. That's a tragic way to die. Maybe you should get off your phone. This isn't heaven just yet. You have to have enough good points to go. Otherwise, you go to the bad place. I don't want to go there. Then you have to go back to Earth to make amends with those you've hurt. Okay, fine. I'll go back to Earth to right my wrongs. The first person you must see is Lacey. Oh my god, no, I hate her. You have to apologize. Fine. Hey, Lacey. Ah! But you just died. I've come back to make amends with you. I'm sorry, it was wrong of me to give you food poisoning so that I could have the lead in the school play. You did that? That's not why I hate you. What? You let my pet bird fly away. Oh yeah, I'm sorry for that too. No, you're not. You know what? I don't forgive you. What? You failed and have two more chances. Would you like to take them? Okay, yes, I'll take them. You have two more chances. Would you like to take them? Okay, yes, I'll take them. The next person is your older sister. Why would I need to apologize to my sister? She loved me. Are you sure about that? Hey, sis. Oh my god, am I hallucinating? No, I've come to make amends. No way, you can't fix what's been done. I don't even know what I did. I thought that you loved me. How could I love you? Our parents gave you everything and they gave me nothing. They clearly liked you more. But that wasn't my fault. But you never stuck up for me or tried to include me. Listen, I'm sorry that they didn't treat you the same as they treat me, but I love you and I would never mean to hurt you like that. I'm sorry too. I've been holding a grudge for so long, but I can let it go. I should have told you how I felt sooner. It's okay. I forgive you. I don't want any bad blood between us. Congratulations, you succeeded. One more and you'll make it to heaven. I can do it. Who is it? Your mother. No, I'm not doing that. You have to unless you want to go to the bad place. Hey bitches, get dressed with me to go to the Melrose Trading Post. If you don't live in LA, you're probably like, Bailey, what the fuck is that? It's basically a flea market with like everything you could ever imagine. I really want to wear this Guns N' Roses baby tee. Emphasis on the baby part because I genuinely got this from the kids section at Target. If it fits, it fits. I have been dying to wear this little green mini skirt. They have struggled, but I think I won. It's very short, so I'm gonna have to walk around like this. I don't know why I can never find a matching sock. They're always close, but just not quite right. I definitely need a jacket because I'm always cold and this one is just so fucking cool. Is this cute? I can't tell. I think I'm gonna try this little crop jacket from Brandy Melville. It's got these insane platform sneakers from Windsor Smith, so I think I have to wear them. Okay, now that I see it with the shoes, I've changed my mind and I'm gonna put this shirt on. Okay, I feel like this outfit just took a full 180. I took off the locket and put on some different bigger chains. I think that this is our final outfit. I really like it. I've been trying to be a little bit more quirky with my outfit because I always wear the same three pieces of clothing. Let me know what you would rate this out of 10 in the comments. Only say four letter words or only speak Spanish. How would that work? I don't even know how to speak Spanish. Four letters it is. Hey sis, I'm having my ex over so don't talk to him. Girl. I know he cheated but he is so hot. Foul. You can judge me all you want but I am in love with him. Hey babe, thanks for having me over. How are you? Good. Uh, okay. Do you care if I go out with the boys tonight? Fine. Are you sure? Are you gaslighting me or something? Nope. Okay, I feel like you're actually mad and just not telling me. Do you have an energy drink? Bang? What? I only banged that girl one time. Exit. Wait, babe. No, no, no. I was just joking. I swear. Door. Fine, I'll go. Honey, did you just break up with him? Oops. He was gonna invite you on a fully paid family trip to Europe. Fuck. 7-1? What? Is my soulmate Bigfoot or something? Man's is like a walking skyscraper. My soulmate's only 5'4". Aw, short king. No, it's not cute. Why not? All of my kids are gonna be so short. <laughs> well, it's better than the ugly gene that you're gonna give them. <gasps> I am not ugly. Um, who are you looking for? My soulmate. That's how you're gonna find him? You know, I don't think I could miss him. He is 7'1". That is so funny considering you're like 4'11", right? Okay, first of all, I'm 5'2". Thank you. Maybe he's like an NBA player. I really hope so. Bro, are you drinking from a salsa jar? A 7'1's not like that tall, right? Are you dumb? That's really tall. What's with all the commotion? Dude, there's a guy in the hall that literally looks like Slenderman. My soulmate! Excuse me, sorry, excuse me, I need to get through. We all want to talk to him, wait your turn. He's definitely not going to talk to you when you look like Shrek. What? Shrek? Ooh. Bro, he's literally built like the Eiffel Tower. Well, how tall do you think he actually is? It's got to be over seven feet. Can y'all stop shoving me like this is the Hunger Games? It's a dude. Wow, wow, wow. These girls are going feral for him. I'm not going to be able to get to him. Um, I think I know how we can. How? 
Here, get onto my shoulders. <laughs> okay. Are you sure this is safe? Nope, not at all. Okay. Hey, moving skyscraper, wait up. Hey, Bailey, how's the weather up there? Shut up. Sir, hi, how tall are you? Um, 7'3". Ugh. What, do you have something against tall guys? Oh, I'm sorry. That just means that you're not my soulmate. How tall is your soulmate? 7'1". Oh, my brother 7'1". A brother? So, where's your brother at? Um, I don't know, he didn't come with me. What do you mean you don't know? It's, like, urgent. Why do you care so much about where my brother is? Uh, hard to explain. You are so weird. I'm out. Uh, wait, please. Bro, no, you're freaking me out. Can you just leave me alone? Okay, I'm sorry. So, do you want to get down, or... Yes, I want to get off your shoulders. Whatever, he looked like a grasshopper, and his brother probably does, too. You're just mad he didn't like you. Do you think that the brother goes here, too? <laughs> Who knows, but he's 7-1. I'll see him. Yeah, but will he even see you? What do you mean? You're just, like, so much shorter than him. I've had enough of the short slander. This is so annoying. Oh, oh my god, there's two of them! Two of who? We need to get his attention, now! Throw something at him! Okay. Not a glass! Oh! Bro, are you kidding me? Which one of you just threw a glass at my head? Should we run? Um, I think so. Yeah, okay. You two, stop right there! So are you the one who threw the glass? <laughs> Guilty. You need to come with us to the office now. Damn, we got caught. There was like 12 witnesses. Thanks to you, he now has a concussion. He has a concussion? I just wanted to get his attention. So you throw the most dangerous thing you could find. It seemed like a better idea at the time. Wait, are you the girl who's been harassing my brother? Uh, no, it wasn't me. Who else would have purple hair? Shit. Could you just tell me why you did it? Because I needed to talk to you. To me? About what? How tall is your soulmate? Um, I am not telling you that. Just tell me. It says 5'2". Wait, don't tell me you think that we're soulmates. Surprise! No way, you are not going to be my soulmate. What's that supposed to mean? You are obviously some kind of crazy. I don't like it. That is not true. I told you why I threw the glass. Yeah, but that doesn't justify it. Uh, well... I am so done with this game you're playing, I'm leaving. No, wait! So, um, I don't think he's gonna press charges. He didn't seem very concussed. That's the girl who threw the glass. <gasps> really? Why are y'all whispering about me when I'm right here? Oh, <laughs> sorry, I didn't know you could hear us. Of course I can hear you! It's just embarrassing that you were so desperate for attention. Whatever, it's also embarrassing that your hair looks like that. My hair is $3,000! Mm. Um, I think that our plan may have backfired a little. Yeah, just like the smallest bit. I know he's my soulmate. I just need a new plan. What? It's not like you can go after his twin. Wait. No, do not tell me that. Hey, you. What? Are you going to throw a glass at my head, too? No. You're going to use me to get my brother. No, that's not what I'm doing at all. I promise. It's clear you're just desperate for a soulmate. No, I was trying to get your attention all along. I just thought you were really cute. Wait, really? Would you want to hang out with me? Yeah, yeah, love to. Here's my number. Thanks. That was, like, suspiciously easy. No, there's got to be a catch, right? There definitely is. He just said that I was harassing him, and he agrees that fast? I don't know. Maybe it's because you're cute. I know. Oh my gosh, what if he, like, murders you or something? Okay, let's not manifest that for me. Thanks. It should be one, four. Yeah, this is it. Hey, uh, welcome in. <laughs> Hi. Both of you. Listen, we just have a few things to ask you. So, why are you such a whore? Excuse me? Uh, I'm just messing with you. That's not one of the questions. Okay, not funny, but go on. You need to tell me how tall your best friend is. She's 5'6", why? Because my soulmate is 5'6", too. Don't tell me you think she's your soulmate. She might be if you're my brother's. I already said I don't want you as a soulmate. I don't want you either, skyscraper. So, can you help me here? No. What? Why not? <laughs> I just don't want to. 
It's because she's a selfish bitch. Can he leave the room? Because he's really killing the vibes. Yeah, bro, get out of here. Listen, I'll help you get my best friend if you help me get your brother. Ah, okay, I guess I can help you. Fine. Deal. Just don't throw any more glasses at his head. I know, that was a one-time thing, I swear. Hmm, I have an idea. I need to go find my best friend. Can you convince your brother not to hate me? I will try my best. Okay, thanks. Bestie. Hey, what's up? I have some tea. Do you want to hear it? Um, yes, always. Do you know that kid who's 7'3"? How could I not? I heard he has a crush on you. Oh, I'm not interested. He's not really my type. What do you mean he's not your type? He's so tall. Yeah, but it's like a little too tall. Didn't you just call your soulmate a walking skyscraper? No, I love men that are two feet taller than me. Right. Just forget it, okay? I don't want him. Wait, please. I'll pay you. Wait, are you serious? <laughs> yeah. How much are we talking here? A thousand dollars. Oh, absolutely. I'll do whatever. Yay. Oh, I'm gonna be dirt poor. This is so dumb. He's not my soulmate anyway. Mine's 5'9". Wait, what? Fight? Girl, I cannot fight anyone. Have you seen me? You have to complete all five levels in order to win. And if I don't? Oh, then you die. Have fun. Wait, I am not ready. You're just as ugly as you were back then. My bully from middle school? The top you're wearing is hideous and I hate your tattoos. You're never going to be better than me. Listen, just because you hate yourself does not mean you can take it out on everyone else. We did not do anything to you and you're just jealous that other people love themselves and you can't. What? I love myself? I won? I have been waiting so many years to say that. Ugh, level two can't be that bad, right? Hey, baby girl, how are you? Oh my god, not you. I waited outside your house this morning, but you didn't come out. Listen, I know I've been nice to you, but I don't actually like you, and you need to take the hint, okay? Please stop hitting on me and showing up to my house. It's weird. You don't like me. I could actually win this. You'll never win against me. 7-1? Uh, what, is my soulmate Bigfoot or something? Man's is like a walking skyscraper. My soulmate's only 5'4! Aw, short king. No, it's not cute. Why not? All of my kids are gonna be so short. <laughs> well, it's better than the ugly gene that you're gonna give them. <gasps> I am not ugly. Um, who are you looking for? <sighs> my soulmate. That's how you're gonna find him? You know, I don't think I could miss him. He is 7'1". That is so funny considering you're like 4'11", right? Okay, first of all, I'm 5'2". Thank you. Maybe he's like an NBA player. I really hope so. Bro, are you drinking from a salsa jar? 7'1's not like that tall, right? Are you dumb? That's really tall. <laughs> What's with all the commotion? Dude, there's a guy in the hall that literally looks like Slenderman. My soulmate! Excuse me, sorry, excuse me, I need to get through. We all want to talk to him, wait your turn. He's definitely not going to talk to you when you look like Shrek. What? Shrek? <sighs> Bro, he's literally built like the Eiffel Tower. Well, how tall do you think he actually is? It's got to be over seven feet. Can y'all stop shoving me like this is the Hunger Games? It's a dude! Wah, wah, wah. These girls are going feral for him, I'm not going to be able to get to him. Um, I think I know how we can. How? Here, get onto my shoulders. <laughs> okay. Are you sure this is safe? Nope, not at all. Okay. Hey, moving skyscraper, wait up. Hey, Bailey, how's the weather up there? Shut up. Sir, hi, how tall are you? Um, 7'3". Ugh. What, do you have something against tall guys? Oh, I'm sorry. That just means that you're not my soulmate. How tall is your soulmate? 7'1". Oh, my brother 7'1". A brother? So, where's your brother at? Um, I don't know. He didn't come with me. What do you mean you don't know? It's, like, urgent. Why do you care so much about where my brother is? Uh, hard to explain. You are so weird. I'm out. Uh, wait, please. Bro, no. You're freaking me out. Can you just leave me alone? Okay, I'm sorry. So, do you want to get down, or... Yes, I want to get off your shoulders. Whatever, he looked like a grasshopper, and his brother probably does, too. You're just mad he didn't like you. Do you think that the brother goes here, too? <laughs> Who knows, but he's 7-1. I'll see him. Yeah, but will he even see you? What do you mean? You're just, like, so much shorter than him. I've had enough of the short slander. This is so annoying. Oh, my God, there's two of them! Two of who? 
We need to get his attention now. Throw something at him. Okay. Not a glass. Oh. Bro, are you kidding me? Which one of you just threw a glass at my head? Should we run? Um, I think so. Yeah, okay. You two, stop right there. So are you the one who threw mm -hmm. the glass? Guilty. You need to come with us to the office now. Damn, we got caught. There was like 12 witnesses. Thanks to you, he now has a concussion. He has a concussion? I just wanted to get his attention. So you throw the most dangerous thing you could find. It seemed like a better idea at the time. Wait, are you the girl who's been harassing my brother? Ah, uh, no, it wasn't me. Who else would have purple hair? Shit. Could you just tell me why you did it? Because I needed to talk to you. To me? About what? How tall is your soulmate? Um, I am not telling you that. Just tell me. It says 5'2". Wait, don't tell me you think that we're soulmates. Surprise! No way, you are not going to be my soulmate. What's that supposed to mean? You are obviously some kind of crazy. I don't like it. That is not true. I told you why I threw the glass. Yeah, but that doesn't justify it. Uh, well... I am so done with this game you're playing, I'm leaving. No, wait! So, um, I don't think he's gonna press charges. He didn't seem very concussed. That's the girl who threw the glass. <gasps> really? Why are y'all whispering about me when I'm right here? Oh, <laughs> sorry, I didn't know you could hear us. Of course I can hear you! It's just embarrassing that you were so desperate for attention. Whatever, it's also embarrassing that your hair looks like that. My hair is $3,000! Mm. Um, I think that our plan may have backfired a little. Yeah, just like the smallest bit. I know he's my soulmate. I just need a new plan. What? It's not like you can go after his twin. Wait. No, do not tell me that. Hey, you. What? Are you going to throw a glass at my head, too? No. You're going to use me to get my brother. No, that's not what I'm doing at all. I promise. It's clear you're just desperate for a soulmate. No, I was trying to get your attention all along. I just thought you were really cute. Wait, really? Would you want to hang out with me? Yeah, yeah, love to. Here's my number. Thanks. That was, like, suspiciously easy. No, there's got to be a catch, right? There definitely is. He just said that I was harassing him, and he agrees that fast? I don't know. Maybe it's because you're cute. I know. Oh my gosh, what if he, like, murders you or something? Okay, let's not manifest that for me. Thanks. It should be one, four. Yep, this is it. Hey, uh, welcome in. <laughs> Hi. Both of you. Listen, we just have a few things to ask you. So, why are you such a whore? Excuse me? Uh, I'm just messing with you. That's not one of the questions. Okay, not funny, but go on. You need to tell me how tall your best friend is. She's 5'6", why? Because my soulmate is 5'6", too. Don't tell me you think she's your soulmate. She might be if you're my brother's. I already said I don't want you as a soulmate. I don't want you either, skyscraper. So, can you help me here? No. What? Why not? <sighs> I just don't want to. It's because she's a selfish bitch. Can he leave the room? Because he's really killing the vibes. Yeah, bro, get out of here. Listen, I'll help you get my best friend if you help me get your brother. Ah, okay, I guess I can help you. Fine. Deal. Just don't throw any more glasses at his head. I know, that was a one-time thing, I swear. Hmm, I have an idea. I need to go find my best friend. Can you convince your brother not to hate me? I will try my best. Okay, thanks. Bestie. Hey, what's up? I have some tea. Do you want to hear it? Um, yes, always. Do you know that kid who's 7'3"? How could I not? I heard he has a crush on you. Oh, I'm not interested. He's not really my type. What do you mean he's not your type? He's so tall. Yeah, but it's like a little too tall. Didn't you just call your soulmate a walking skyscraper? No, I love men that are two feet taller than me. Right. Just forget it, okay? I don't want him. Wait, please. I'll pay you. Wait, are you serious? <laughs> yeah. How much are we talking here? A thousand dollars. Oh, absolutely. I'll do whatever. Yay! Oh, I'm gonna be dirt poor. This is so dumb. He's not my soulmate anyway. Mine's 5'9". Wait, what? One of my front teeth is fake. Yeah, this one right in the front. 
I was always a little bit of a rebel when I was young. But this one time I got too crazy. I loved being outside when I was a kid. I had a bike, scooter, penny board, and rollerblades. One summer day, I was riding my scooter down the driveway as I always did. And this was a very steep driveway. Here's a representation of the slope. Typically, I would go down the slope and then ride into the road. I don't know what I was thinking, but I decided it would be very fun to take a sharp turn onto the sidewalk. Spoiler alert, it was not a good idea. I had done this turn a few times before, so I wasn't really worried. I should have been. Well, I go down the driveway and make this turn. You can probably guess what happened. I went face first into the sidewalk. The impact was right here, and I thought I just had a cut or something. I start crying, and I go inside. My mom takes one look at me and notices that my tooth in the front is just missing. Where did it go? I don't know. I have a tooth now because a dentist fixed it. Funny enough, you actually have to get the tooth replaced every 10 years. This is my second tooth because I pulled out the first one eating a piece of taffy. The moral of this story is don't be like me. Ever. <laughs> Seven one. What is my soulmate Bigfoot or something? Man's is like a walking skyscraper. My soulmate's only five four. Ah, short king. No, it's not cute. Why not? All of my kids are gonna be so short. <laughs> well, it's better than the ugly gene that you're gonna give them. I am not ugly. Um, who are you looking for? My soulmate. That's how you're gonna find him. You know, I don't think I could miss him. He is 7'1". That is so funny considering you're like 4'11", right? Okay, first of all, I'm 5'2". Thank you. Maybe he's like an NBA player. I really hope so. Bro, are you drinking from a salsa jar? 7'1's not like that tall, right? Are you dumb? That's really tall. <laughs> What's with all the commotion? Dude, there's a guy in the hall that literally looks like Slenderman. My soulmate! Excuse me, sorry, excuse me, I need to get through. We all want to talk to him, wait your turn. He's definitely not going to talk to you when you look like Shrek. What? Shrek? Oh. Bro, he's literally built like the Eiffel Tower. Well, how tall do you think he actually is? It's got to be over seven feet. Can y'all stop shoving me like this is the Hunger Games? It's a dude! Wah, wah, wah. These girls are going feral for him, I'm not going to be able to get to him. Um, I think I know how we can. How? Here, get onto my shoulders. <laughs> okay. Are you sure this is safe? Nope, not at all. Okay. Hey, moving skyscraper, wait up. Hey, Bailey, how's the weather up there? Shut up. Sir, hi, how tall are you? Um, 7'3". Ugh. What, do you have something against tall guys? Oh, I'm sorry. That just means that you're not my soulmate. How tall is your soulmate? 7'1". Oh, my brother, 7'1". A brother? So, where's your brother at? Um, I don't know. He didn't come with me. What do you mean you don't know? It's, like, urgent. Why do you care so much about where my brother is? Uh, hard to explain. You are so weird. I'm out. Uh, wait, please. Bro, no. You're freaking me out. Can you just leave me alone? Okay, I'm sorry. So, do you want to get down, or... Yes, I want to get off your shoulders. Whatever, he looked like a grasshopper, and his brother probably does, too. You're just mad he didn't like you. Do you think that the brother goes here, too? <laughs> Who knows, but he's 7-1. I'll see him. Yeah, but will he even see you? What do you mean? You're just, like, so much shorter than him. I've had enough of the short slander. This is so annoying. Oh, oh my god, there's two of them! Two of who? We need to get his attention, now! Throw something at him! Okay. Not a glass! Oh! Bro, are you kidding me? Which one of you just threw a glass at my head? Should we run? Um, I think so. Yeah, okay. You two, stop right there! So are you the one who threw mm -hmm. the glass? Guilty. You need to come with us to the office now. Damn, we got caught. There was like 12 witnesses. Thanks to you, he now has a concussion. He has a concussion? I just wanted to get his attention. So you throw the most dangerous thing you could find. It seemed like a better idea at the time. Wait, are you the girl who's been harassing my brother? Uh, no, it wasn't me. Who else would have purple hair? Shit. Could you just tell me why you did it? Because I needed to talk to you. To me? About what? How tall is your soulmate? Um, I am not telling you that. Just tell me. It says 5'2". Wait, don't tell me you think that we're soulmates. Surprise! 
No way. You are not going to be my soulmate. What's that supposed to mean? You are obviously some kind of crazy. I don't like it. That is not true. I told you why I threw the glass. Yeah, but that doesn't justify it. Uh, well... I am so done with this game you're playing. I'm leaving. No, wait! So, um, I don't think he's gonna press charges. He didn't seem very concussed. That's the girl who threw the glass. <gasps> really? Why are y'all whispering about me when I'm right here? Oh, <laughs> sorry. I didn't know you could hear us. Of course I can hear you. It's just embarrassing that you were so desperate for attention. Whatever. It's also embarrassing that your hair looks like that. My hair is $3,000. <laughs> um, I think that our plan may have backfired a little. Yeah, just like the smallest bit. I know he's my soulmate. I just need a new plan. What? It's not like you can go after his twin. Wait. No, do not tell me that. Hey, you. What? Are you going to throw a glass at my head, too? No. You're going to use me to get my brother. No, that's not what I'm doing at all. I promise. It's clear you're just desperate for a soulmate. No, I was trying to get your attention all along. I just thought you were really cute. Wait, really? Would you want to hang out with me? Yeah, yeah, love to. Here's my number. Thanks. That was, like, suspiciously easy. No, there's got to be a catch, right? There definitely is. He just said that I was harassing him, and he agrees that fast? I don't know. Maybe it's because you're cute. I know. Oh my gosh, what if he, like, murders you or something? Okay, let's not manifest that for me. Thanks. It should be one, four. Yep, this is it. Hey, uh, welcome in. <laughs> Hi. Both of you? Listen, we just have a few things to ask you. So, why are you such a whore? Excuse me? Oh, I'm just messing with you. That's not one of the questions. Okay, not funny, but go on. You need to tell me how tall your best friend is. She's 5'6", why? Because my soulmate is 5'6", too. Don't tell me you think she's your soulmate. She might be if you're my brother's. I already said I don't want you as a soulmate. I don't want you either, skyscraper. So, can you help me here? No. What? Why not? <laughs> I just don't want to. It's because she's a selfish bitch. Can he leave the room? Because he's really killing the vibes. Yeah, bro, get out of here. Listen, I'll help you get my best friend if you help me get your brother. Ah, okay, I guess I can help you. Fine. Deal. Just don't throw any more glasses at his head. I know, that was a one-time thing, I swear. Hmm, I have an idea. I need to go find my best friend. Can you convince your brother not to hate me? I will try my best. Okay, thanks. Bestie. Hey, what's up? I have some tea. Do you want to hear it? Um, yes, always. Do you know that kid who's 7'3"? How could I not? I heard he has a crush on you. Oh, I'm not interested. He's not really my type. What do you mean he's not your type? He's so tall. Yeah, but it's like a little too tall. Didn't you just call your soulmate a walking skyscraper? No, I love men that are two feet taller than me. Right. Just forget it, okay? I don't want him. Wait, please. I'll pay you. Wait, are you serious? <laughs> yeah. How much are we talking here? A thousand dollars. Oh, absolutely. I'll do whatever. Yay. Oh, I'm gonna be dirt poor. This is so dumb. He's not my soulmate anyway. Mine's 5'9". Wait, what? Dude, I got tickets to a rock concert tonight. Want to come with? I don't know. Rock music isn't really my thing. Ugh, no wonder your innocence is 100%. Wait, I'll come with you. <gasps> Great, but you're not wearing that. My outfit is fine. I like being comfortable. <laughs> you're gonna regret that. Tickets, please. Oh, honey, Disney on Ice is next door. Actually, I'm here for the rock concert. Oh, okay then, go ahead. You sure you don't want the outfit? Give it to me. You look so cool, and where did you get the boobs? Shut up. Jessica, I didn't know that you were coming. Oh my god, hey guys. Lucky you, we have two extra backstage passes. Do you want them? We'll take them. Come on guys, let's meet the band. Uh, excuse me miss. Hmm? I think that you dropped this. Oh, uh, thank you. Dude, that was the lead singer of the band. What does the paper say? It has a phone number and it says, call me for a good time. Dude, you have to call him. No way, that's out of my comfort zone. Ugh, no wonder your score is so high, you're no fun. Come on, let's just go watch the show. Wait, guys. 
I can't call him because I'm a virgin. What? We can't hear what you're saying. I'm a virgin. Yeah, no shit. We could have guessed that ourselves. You never know. Maybe he doesn't want to hook up with you. He wrote call me for a good time. What else does that mean? Either you call him or I'll do it for you. Fine, I'll call him after the show. Thank you guys so much for the support. Have a great night. Don't look at me like that. I'm gonna call him. Hello? Who is this? Uh, hi, this is the girl from backstage. Oh, good. I was hoping that you would call. Come meet me in my dressing room backstage. Ah, uh, yeah, sure. Oh, hey, come on in. I wanted to talk to you. Hi, what's up? So, have you ever thought about becoming a singer before? I, I mean, I was in chorus, but not really. Our lead singer had a family emergency, and she's going to be gone for three weeks. Hang on a minute. Are you asking me to be in the band? Kinda. I want you to come to our tryouts later this week. Your style's cool. I think you'd make a great addition. Okay, maybe I will. Bro! Oh, were you guys eavesdropping? Yeah, we had to. You are definitely trying out. Guys, I don't even know if I can sing or not. Do you want to get your innocence score lower or not? Guys, I can't sing this song. This has a bad word in it. You're not a toddler. You can swear. You're freaking out about nothing. That was so good. Okay, I guess the worst they can say is no. Okay, this is actually happening. I'm really scared. You practice for this. You're going to be just fine. Next in line for auditions, please. Wish me luck. It doesn't matter if he's a third cousin, he's still your cousin. Come on, he's so hot though. No one can understand me or no one can listen to me. I think I'll start crying if nobody listens to me. Oh, hey Bailey, what's up? Ashibu. What did you just say? <clears throat> Abu -dabu. What the fuck, are you okay? Ashibu Dwarf. You're genuinely freaking me out. We're going to do presentations today. Bailey, you can go first. Don't even, I just heard you talking to your friends. Go ahead now. <clears throat> You should go to the nurse. So, Han, I heard you weren't feeling very well. Uh, could you repeat that? Oh, no, this is serious. You must be possessed. I'm going to call for an exorcism. Oh! The demon is getting angrier. One of my front teeth is fake. Yeah, this one right in the front. I was always a little bit of a rebel when I was young, but this one time I got too crazy. I loved being outside when I was a kid. I had a bike, scooter, penny board, and rollerblades. One summer day, I was riding my scooter down the driveway as I always did, and this was a very steep driveway. Here's a representation of the slope. Typically, I would go down the slope and then ride into the road. I don't know what I was thinking, but I decided it would be very fun to take a sharp turn onto the sidewalk. Spoiler alert, it was not a good idea. I had done this turn a few times before, so I wasn't really worried. I should have been. Well, I go down the driveway and make this turn. You can probably guess what happened. I went face first into the sidewalk. The impact was right here and I thought I just had a cut or something. I start crying and I go inside. My mom takes one look at me and notices that my tooth in the front is just missing. Where did it go? I don't know. I have a tooth now because a dentist fixed it. Funny enough, you actually have to get the tooth replaced every 10 years. This is my second tooth because I pulled out the first one eating a piece of taffy. The moral of this story is don't be like me. Ever. <laughs> Sis, I swear, if you make the bathroom smell that bad again... Okay, sorry, I won't. Everyone can't see me or everyone can't hear me. I feel like I could use being invisible for a day. I am so glad Bailey's not here today. I genuinely hate her. Me too, she's so annoying. Fake-ass bitch. Why is there a dick on your face? What? What do you mean? Class, settle down and get that off of your face. Asshat. Hey, who said that? Mary. Huh? What? The answer is 76. Where is that voice coming from? I'm a genie, and I'm going to get you 100% on this test. Really? Thank you so much. Do people still feel if I hit them? Ow, what the fuck? Quiet, we're testing. Marissa, why did you answer in the shape of a Christmas tree? Because the magic genie told me to do it this way. <laughs> wow, okay, how about we take you to get some help? Hey, sis. Oh my god, what is that smell? That McDonald's bag has been in here since like 2012. I think that just burned all the hair off the inside of my nose. Yes, I was not done being invisible. Bro, I just matched with the finest girl on Tinder. Does your girlfriend Bailey know that? No, of course not. Dude, why would you pour that on me? It looks like I pissed my pants. <laughs> it wasn't me. Where did that laugh come from? I can't believe the teacher thought I was crazy yesterday. The genie was real. Ow, bitch, why would you push me? I didn't push you. You little bitch. 
All right, everyone, today we will be having a pop quiz. Everyone, please take out a pencil and- Okay, who did that? It's not funny. No one's by the light switch. We have a dog! 30 people can't oh die! Oh my gosh, no! I'm too young to die! Oh, wait, Annie sounds kind of cute. I could go with that. So what name did you get? Oh, it says Annie Rection. Bailey, are you serious? I think you need to read that one more time. What? What do you mean? Do you hear what you're saying? Annie Rection. Oh! <gasps> <gasps> Decline! Oh my god, I can't believe I almost accepted that! You need to figure out how to read, apparently. Whatever. Remember, you can only decline two times. I know, but the next one has to be better than that. Yeah, you better hope so. Ben. I mean, that's usually a boy's name, but I could go by Ben. What is it this time? Ben Dover. Girl, you have got to be kidding me, right? Not again. Oh, hey, Amanda. Yeah, that's not my name anymore. It's Taylor Swift now. That's the name you got? Yeah, isn't it awesome? What did you get? You don't want to know. Please be good. PP time. I don't want to be called PP. Sis, please tell me there's another way to change my name. There is, but you're not going to like it. Tell me how to change my name. I can't be called PP time forever. The only way that you can change your name now is to go and steal one from someone else. What? I'm not doing that. I knew you would say that. What happens if I just hit the decline button again? No, no, you cannot do that. Why not? Because your name will be completely randomized. It might be better. Or it could be like way worse. Fine, how do I steal a name? All you need to do is slap someone in the face and their name transfers over to you. Hey, Taylor. Oh, hey, girl, what's going on? Dude, why did you just slap me? You said that would work. Okay, I was just kidding. I didn't know you were really going to do it. <clears throat> Sorry, I think your only choice is just to hit decline. Okay. Please. Mike Hunt. Whoa, I'm sorry. What did you just say? Mike Hunt. That's what it says. Do you hear yourself? Mike Hunt. I can't even say that with a straight face. You should have took pee pee time. I know that now. There has to be someone I can talk to to fix this. Try going to their headquarters here. Hi, I'm- Take a ticket and wait in the line. Your number will be called. Okay. Number 69, Mike Hunt. Please don't call me that. So, what seems to be the problem? All of the names that I got were prank names. That's odd. Was it every name you got? That is definitely not right. We'll fix it for you. Really? Amazing. According to our database, someone hacked into your name system. Why would someone do that? To block you from getting your true identity. Have you met your family before? I live with them? No, I mean like your birth family. I'm sorry to tell you this, but I think you were kidnapped as a kid. What? What are you talking about? Well, you look exactly like Queen Meredith did when she was young. Okay, and a lot of people look alike. It's uncanny, but the whole family died in a car accident. Princess Sophia is still alive. Yes, but I believe that you are her. No, the system already gave that name away to the girl who it belonged to. That's what I'm trying to tell you. It didn't belong to her. It belongs to you, and that's why they blocked it. What? But why would someone want to steal my identity? To uncover the fortune of the royal family. How much money are we talking about? Seven billion dollars. We have to stop them, right? Today we want you to go home and do not say anything. Why would I do that? Because we're gonna come take care of it. Hey, sweetheart, I'm so sorry about the terrible name you got. It's fine, I can just make a nickname. FBI, open up! Quick, grab Sophia, we need to get out of here right now. Sis, I swear, if you make the bathroom smell that bad again... Okay, sorry, I won't. Everyone can't see me or everyone can't hear me. I feel like I could use being invisible for a day. I am so glad Bailey's not here today. I genuinely hate her. Me too, she's so annoying. Fake ass bitch. Why is there a dick on your face? What? What do you mean? Class, settle down and get that off of your face. Ass hat. Hey, who said that? Mary. Huh? What? The answer is 76. Where is that voice coming from? I'm a genie, and I'm going to get you 100% on this test. Really? Thank you so much. Do people still feel if I hit them? Ow, what the fuck? Quiet, we're testing. Marissa, why did you answer in the shape of a Christmas tree? Because the magic genie told me to do it this way. <laughs> wow, okay, how about we take you to get some help? Hey, sis. Oh my god, what is that smell? That McDonald's bag has been in here since like 2012. I think that just burned all the hair off the inside of my nose. Yes! I was not done being invisible. Bro, I just matched with the finest girl on Tinder. Does your girlfriend Bailey know that? No, of course not. Dude, why would you pour that on me? It looks like I pissed my pants. <laughs> it wasn't me. Where did that laugh come from? I can't believe the teacher thought I was crazy yesterday. The genie was real. 
Ow, bitch. Why would you push me? I didn't push you. You little bitch. All right, everyone. Today, we will be having a pop quiz. Everyone, please take out a pencil. And Okay, who did that? It's not funny. No one's by the light switch. We have a dog. Pretty people can't oh die. My gosh, no. I'm too young to die. Oh, no. Oh, no. Did you eat my leftovers when I told you not to? Mmm, so yummy. You're so annoying. I told you I was going to eat that. Gobble, gobble. What are you, a turkey? You are not funny. Stop. What is wrong with you? <gasps> glizzy gobbler. Did you just call me a glizzy gobbler? Okay, blink if you need help. Ooh, too spicy. Have you blinked at all today? Thank you for the gift. Am I in a simulation right now? <gasps> glizzy gobbler. Please, please stop calling me that. Anything but that. Why are you moving your arms like that? Is that a dumb bitch? Excuse me, I am not. Are you being possessed or something? Mmm, I love ice cream. Okay, that's it. I'm calling the police right now. You have to keep blinking. Girl, I'm trying. I'm kind of forgetting how to blink. What? How many did you get? Two. You cannot let them run out. Okay. Hey, Bailey, look at me. No. Why? You're just staring at the wall. I know you're going to make me try to blink, and I literally have two, so don't do it. Class, today for home ec, we're going to be cutting up some onions. Are you kidding me? Can I opt out of this activity? No, it's a mandatory grade. I feel sick. Ugh. Ugh, fine. Okay, thank you. Honey, what's wrong? You look like a deer in headlights. You need to take some eye drops. I can't take eye drops. Those will make me blink. Your eyes are irritated. You need to. <laughs> hey, wait. I'll give you some blinks. I have a lot. Oh, my gosh. Thank you. Okay, I think they're transferring right now. Oh. Oh. oh my gosh, you're a lifesaver. Does this mean I can get your number now? That was fast and forward. Why are you still making that face? What face? Shocked? You have blinks. Oh, I forgot. <laughs> you almost ran out of blinks. Be careful. Oh, it's fine. No one even knows what happens when you run out. Um, I do. You die. What? I cannot believe that you didn't know. How do you know that? I thought it was obvious that everyone knew. <laughs> Whatever you do, don't run out of blinks. You're freaking me out. Ten, nine, eight, seven. Guys, what's going on in here? Billy's about to use all of his blinks at once. Stop, don't do it. Boo, annoying bitch. If you run out of blinks, you die. Ah, what? I only have five blinks left. Wait, guys, don't panic. Everyone calm down, crying will use up your blinks. Uh-oh. <laughs> We're all gonna die. Guys, please, there must be another way we can just not blink. What if everyone just kept their eyes closed? How is everyone gonna see if our eyes are shut? It's better than totally running out of blinks. There is no way this is gonna work. Okay, open your eyes. How many blinks did you lose? It only went down one. That means it works. Everybody, close your eyes. Everyone's just gonna start running into the walls. Well, it's better than everybody dying, huh? I guess so. I think that it's this way. Oh, that looked like it hurt. Everyone, we need your attention now. I wonder what this is about. You don't die when you run out of blinks. You just can't see. So you're a liar? What? No, I didn't know. But you told me that... Haha, <laughs> sorry I lied. April Fools? It's not even April! Get her! Guys, please, it was a mistake. How much energy did you get today, honey? 2%. No, that's not good at all. Bailey, you cannot be sleeping on that right now. Well, he's my friend. You're supposed to lead us in the debate. You're gonna make us all fail. Here, drink this. What is it? It's a secret magic potion. Good, I think it'll make you feel better. How do you feel? Oh, okay. Are you good? Have you guys ever done a backflip? Because I've never done one and I feel like I could do one right now. Yeah, I don't think you should try that. Do you remember the debate materials? Oh yeah, I remember everything since the beginning of time. Okay, let's hope that you do well then. Would both parties please introduce themselves? Hi, I like sleeping, eating, going to the bathroom, having snacks, going to the gym, going for a hike, painting. Okay, that's quite enough. And stop moving. I can't stop moving. It's in my blood. I got the dancing juices going through me. This is not dance class. What was in that drink you gave me? Can I have four more of them? I've never felt better in my entire life. I feel like I conquered the entire world right now and become president i think i made a mistake bailey hello she's on zero you shouldn't have given her that drink dude i think you broke her uh nurse i can bring her energy back up but we don't know where it will land do it we need her to win
Okay, she's back. Whoa! That's way too much energy. Where is she going? Wait, where did you just go? I just ran an entire lap around the school. Do you want to see me do it again? I can do it in one second. Nurse, you have to try again. This can't be right. All right, let me try restarting the system again. Maybe it'll fix her. No, no, no. Now she doesn't have any energy at all. We need her. I don't feel so well. Suck it up, cupcake. You need to try it again. She's literally snoring. I can restart one more time, but any more than that and she'll die. <gasps> 89%. That's perfect. She can compete. Hashi Bubeldorf. Um, what did you just say? Says Columbia. Oh, I forgot to mention there might be some side effects to the restart. You can't sleep with your professor. He's like 70. He'll turn into dust. Ugh, I have a thing for DILFs. Only speak in song lyrics or don't speak at all. Ha! <laughs> I cannot shut up. Did you do something different to your hair? It looks like shit. Why you gotta be so mean? I'm trying to save you, okay? So, did you see that your boyfriend cheated on you with Macy? I give my all, then I get hurt. I always thought he was ugly anyway. What are you gonna do about it? <laughs> Karma is my boyfriend. Babe, why would you make a TikTok about me? I'm getting dragged in the comments. Do you even like me? I like you, I do. You said get ready with me to break up with my boyfriend. I love you. How could you do this? You can't love anyone because that would mean you had a heart. Two years down the drain. Whatever. We're over. God, it's brutal out here. Romance is dead. Guess the song for $10 million? I'm going to be so good at this. 90% of my brain is song lyrics. I'm a doll, but I still want to party. <gasps> I just heard this. It was in the Barbie movie. It has to be Barbie World. Yes, I am totally gonna win. You have a peanut brain. There's no way you can win. Yeah, you wanna bet? Yeah, whoever loses has to clean the entire house for a year. Deal. 100 bands of chanel -y. What? Is that like a kind of pasta? Oh my god, why are you shaking your ass? Um, because I'm trying to get famous on TikTok. I'm dancing to Ice Spice's new song. Deli! This is way too easy. At least give me something hard. Why does it feel like I'm never enough? I feel like I've heard that somewhere before. Oh, runner up. Duh. Won't somebody give me the antidote? I have never heard that before. How am I supposed to guess? Better figure it out or I'll win. Dude, I got tickets to a rock concert tonight. Want to come with? I don't know. Rock music isn't really my thing. Ugh, no wonder your innocence is 100%. Wait, I'll come with you. <gasps> Great, but you're not wearing that. My outfit is fine. I like being comfortable. <laughs> you're going to regret that. Tickets, please. Oh, honey, Disney on Ice is next door. Actually, I'm here for the rock concert. Oh, okay, then go ahead. You sure you don't want the outfit? Give it to me. You look so cool. And where did you get the boobs? Shut up. Jessica, I didn't know that you were coming. Oh, my God. Hey, guys. Lucky you. We have two extra backstage passes. Do you want them? We'll take them. Come on, guys. Let's meet the band. Uh, excuse me, miss. Hmm? I think that you dropped this. Oh, uh, thank you. Dude, that was the lead singer of the band. What does the paper say? It has a phone number and it says, call me for a good time. Dude, you have to call him. No way, that's out of my comfort zone. Ugh, no wonder your score is so high. You're no fun. Come on, let's just go watch the show. Wait, guys, I can't call him because I'm a virgin. What? We can't hear what you're saying. I'm a virgin. Yeah, no shit. We could have guessed that ourselves. You never know. Maybe he doesn't want to hook up with you. He wrote, call me for a good time. What else does that mean? Either you call him or I'll do it for you. Fine, I'll call him after the show. Thank you guys so much for the support. Have a great night. Don't look at me like that. I'm going to call him. Hello? Who is this? Uh, hi, this is the girl from backstage. Oh, good. I was hoping that you would call. Come meet me in my dressing room backstage. Ah, uh, yeah, sure. Oh, hey, come on in. I wanted to talk to you. Hi, what's up? So, have you ever thought about becoming a singer before? I, I mean, I was in chorus, but not really. Our lead singer had a family emergency, and she's going to be gone for three weeks. Hang on a minute. Are you asking me to be in the band? Kinda. I want you to come to our tryouts later this week. Your style's cool. I think you'd make a great addition. Okay, maybe I will. Bro! Oh, were you guys eavesdropping? Yeah, we had to. You are definitely trying out. Guys, I don't even know if I can sing or not. Do you want to get your innocence score lower or not? Guys, I can't sing this song. This has a bad word in it. You're not a toddler. You can swear. You're freaking out about nothing. That was so good. Okay, I guess the worst they can say is no. 
Okay, this is actually happening. I'm really scared. You practice for this. You're gonna be just fine. Next in line for auditions, please. Wish me luck. You can't sleep with your professor. He's like 70. He'll turn into dust. Ugh, I have a thing for DILFs. Only speak in song lyrics or don't speak at all. Ha! <laughs> I cannot shut up. Did you do something different to your hair? It looks like shit. Why you gotta be so mean? I'm trying to save you, okay? So, did you see that your boyfriend cheated on you with Macy? I give my all, then I get hurt. I always thought he was ugly anyway. What are you gonna do about <laughs> it? Karma is my boyfriend. Babe, why would you make a TikTok about me? I'm getting dragged in the comments. Do you even like me? I like you, I do. You said get ready with me to break up with my boyfriend. I love you, how could you do this? You can't love anyone, cause that would mean you had a heart. Two years down the drain, whatever, we're over. God, it's brutal out here. Romance is dead. Hey, does this shirt look bad on me? Yeah, it's hideous on you. I really hope that my soulmate has never lied too. Yeah, I don't think that it's a good thing. You have no friends because you're so brutal. I have friends. Your squishmallows don't count. Bestie, have you heard the rumor? No, what rumor? Well, I heard that. Ladies, no talking. I'll have to separate you. You can't switch our seats. I have social anxiety and she's the only one that I like. You should have thought about that before disrupting the whole class. Go sit with Jack. Ugh. Oh, can I please sit somewhere else? He smells so bad. You know I can hear, right? I don't even smell. I showered like two days ago. Sorry, that was a little bit brutal. Yeah, you think? So, where are you from, Stinky? Um, I was born in, uh, Maryland, yeah. What part of Maryland? The one where they catch the crabs. That's definitely not true. Who fucking cares anyway? I can lie if I want to. Your brain cells must be at Disneyland. Yeehaw! Country Bailey unlocked. We're meeting mom's boyfriend today, so you can't be weird. Save a horse, ride a cowboy. We're fucked. Hey, my name is Matt. Nice to meet you. <gasps> Ooh, that was the cringiest thing ever. I'm happy to be here. <gasps> Stranger danger! Ow, you punched me in the face. It was a ghost. We just watched you do it. Okay, guys, how about we just eat dinner instead? Behold the magic of the spork. Dude, what? We don't even own a spork. Ooh, shiny. Okay, are you kidding? It's not for your hair. You use it to eat. Who am I kidding? You're as smart as a toenail. It doesn't taste very good. Every time I interact with you, I think I lose 15 brain cells. Um, what the hell is on top of your head? Where did you get that? The depths of hell. Okay, I think I have to go home, huh? You got infinite brain cells? That is not fair. I'm sorry, please take these flowers as a gift. You didn't have those one second ago. Where'd they come from? I can make anything appear out of thin air. Would you like something else? Yeah, can I have a Chanel bag? Here you go, one Chanel bag. This is the coolest thing ever. Hey, wait, could you give me five billion dollars? No, I cannot create money. Hi, we'd like to return this bag for cash. Okay, you'll be getting back 4,100. But we did not actually buy- Shut the fuck up right now, right now. Never mind. Can you get me a laptop? I already have one. How did you know I wanted it? I can also read minds. Are you kidding me? What am I thinking about right now? The Taco Bell Mexican pizza. That sounds so good right now. Hey, could you like spawn me in a boyfriend? No, that would be a miracle and I cannot do that. Uh, bitch! Can you at least try to spawn me a boyfriend? Sure thing. There you go. Are you kidding me? That's a frog. I can only give you someone equally as attractive as you are. Uh, are you calling me ugly right now? Precisely. Okay, then make me beautiful. Of course. Ta-da! Dude, I look like handsome Squidward. Sorry, you did not specify. Who would want to look like this? How much money is in my bank account? You have negative $420. Okay, damn, you don't need to say it that loudly. Can you give me a drink? I'm thirsty. Here you go. No, that's ant killer. Are you trying to tell me to drink it? Drink up, bitch. Okay, now you're just starting to scare me. <gasps> What's my crush thinking about? Hooking up with a teacher. I knew he was too friendly with the Spanish teacher. Oh, hey, Bailey. Uh, What are you doing? Are we about to eat a five-course meal or something? Hungies. Ew, what the fuck? That was so cringy. Feed me. Girl, you are old. Bring your own lunch to school. Do you even have anything with you? Why do you have that here? Put it down. Alcohol is cool, but have you ever had someone care about you? Me neither. Pass the bottle. You must have something else. Is that toilet paper? Are you serious? Your cute jeans. Please, anything edible. Is that a bra? Ew, whose is that? Your mom's. Oh, ha ha ha, you're so funny. Don't put it on your head. You don't know where that bra has been, girl. Back, I say, back. Somebody sedate her. Finally, at least you have a drink. Who the hell drinks like that? Is this like a glitch in the matrix or something? Because I don't understand. Can you just be normal? Uh, excuse you. <gasps> hey, Bailey. 
You made me mess up my lip gloss. Our ranks are gonna come out. Let's look together. Sweet, I'm under 100th place. I think there's been a mistake. It says that I'm over 1,000. Yeah, I don't care. Suck it up, sorry. Wow, and I thought my rank was really bad. I thought that people liked you. Apparently they don't. Oh, hey, babe. Hey, I'm breaking up with you because I've decided to replace you with her instead. Sorry, didn't mean to hurt you. I guess I'm single now, but I still have my best friend. I mean, I'm definitely your best friend. I know that I can get my place higher than this. Ugh, I'm gonna trip. Do you need some help carrying all that? That would be amazing. Here, you can take this. Shit, I forgot to do the homework. Do you want to look at mine? I did it. Oh my gosh, yes, thank you. Bailey, are you letting her cheat off you? No, she was just asking for help. That's it, pop quiz for the whole class. Boo, you suck. Boo. Why does it feel like I'm never enough? I think we can help each other. How would we help each other? I want you to be in a fake relationship with me so people will get off my back about being single. No way, this isn't to all the boys I've left before. Listen, I'm the quarterback, and if you date me, your rank will immediately become higher. Deal. Hey guys, this is my girlfriend. You're dating him? Yeah, I am. You know, I forgive you for getting me detention yesterday. Great, then we can be friends. Yeah, definitely. See, I told you this was going to work. Are you guys running for prom queen and king? Uh, I don't know about that. Yeah, of course we are. I did not agree to this. Okay, then you can continue to be a loser. How did my rank move up that quickly? Um, it's because you're dating me. Everyone loves me. Your head is so big, I'm surprised it doesn't fall off. Hey, sis, wait up. Get away from me or I'll punch you in the gut. Did I do something wrong? Yes, dude, you took my spot. What do you mean I took your spot? I used to be under 100 and now I'm not because of you. Sis, I didn't mean to take your spot. I'm sorry. Get away from me. I don't want to talk to you. Doesn't it feel good having a higher rank than before? It doesn't. Hey, we're all going to hang out after school. You should totally come. Oh, and Bailey, you can come if you want, I guess. I'll pass. Just so you know, I'm totally voting for you for prom queen. Oh, uh, thank you. But your boyfriend is still way cooler than you and you'll never be like him. You're going to be so popular after we win. I don't know if that's what I want. Hey, we had a deal and you are not about to back out on me right now. Okay. Everyone vote for me for prom queen. Sis, you're running for prom queen too? Can you hear? That's literally what I just said, and I'm running against you. You're never going to be enough, and I'll prove that to you by winning. What is your problem? I gotta go. What? Why is my rank dropping? Um, there's a video of your so-called boyfriend making out with Mary earlier today. Oh, no. If he's the one who cheated, then why is my rank dropping? Because everyone knows you're faking the relationship. What? It's not fake. You guys don't go near each other and you've never kissed. No one really believes you're a couple. Fine, I'll prove it to you. Hey, babe. Uh, oh, uh, hey. Just so you guys know, we're actually in an open relationship. We are? Sweet. I am so sorry that I misjudged you. Yeah, you should be. That was a good save. What were you thinking? That Mary was hot and I wanted to make out with her. Mom is tomorrow. Don't do anything stupid again. Oh, you're the one yelling now? Uno reverse. Mary, what the fuck? I told you to make sure they broke up. You sabotaged me? Oh, hey. Yeah, I sent Mary over to kiss your boyfriend. Hey, guys, just so everyone knows, my boyfriend is actually hosting a free prom party, and you're all invited. Woo! I'm so excited. Hell yeah. Wait, what? I didn't know that we were throwing a party. We are now. This is not over yet. Okay, so where are we throwing this party? Your house. What? I don't want to have all these people over at my house. Don't worry, it'll only be like 50 people. Okay, fine, but that's it, all right? I don't know about this. The first people are here. Hey, guys. Hey, what's up, Bailey? Is it cool that I brought the whole football team with me? Yeah, it's totally cool. Come on in. Oh, my God, hey. Hey, girls, come on in. This is so cool of you. Dude, there's like 500 people here. Relax, it's gonna be so worth it when we win. No, you can't throw up in that vase. It was my mother's. That looked expensive. I love this party you got going on. What are you doing here? Everybody at school was going, so I was too. Last time I checked, you are definitely not on the list, so I'm gonna need you to leave. Dude, are you being serious right now? You're gonna kick me out? Yeah, see you later. Damn, don't need to knock so loud, I'm coming. Hello? Hello, ma'am, this is the sheriff's department. Are you the owner of this home? We've received complaints. Nope, it's his house. Bro, what the fuck? How are you gonna throw me under the bus like that? Guys, relax, it's just a noise complaint. Keep it down, okay? Oh, okay, yeah, we can keep the noise down. Enjoy your prom night. No, you were supposed to shut it down. Of course you would be behind this, and why are you even still here? Oh, I was peeing in that bush outside. You're in second and I'm right behind you. Better watch your back. Mm, I'm not worried. 
Wow, you look- Don't? I was just trying to be nice. Are you positive that we're gonna win? Oh yeah, I'm positive about it. How do you know? Yeah, that's because I rigged all the ballots so we would win. What? You rigged it? Shh! It all worked out. You wanted to be more popular and now you're second forever. What? I don't want to be second. Well, you'll never be better than me. Everyone, it's time to announce our prom king and queen. Your prom king for 2023 is Jack Daniels. Thank you guys, I never would have seen this coming. And for prom queen? Oh, it looks like there's been a tie. A tie? No, there can't be a tie. You're not in the tie. You didn't even make it to the finals. The tie that you have is with Misty Daniels. Who's Misty? Uh, my sister. I didn't know you had a sister. Yeah, I try not to tell people. I don't see Misty anywhere. So, Bailey, do you want to come get your crown? Okay. Here you go. Would you like to say anything to the crowd? Yeah, I would. A week ago, I would have cried with this crown on my head. But now that I'm up here, all I can think is... Why does it even matter? I think all of you are special and beautiful in your own way, so really this crown belongs to everyone. Bailey, what are you doing? I'm doing what's right. Everyone, Jack cheated the system so that we would win. No, <gasps> whoa, oh my gosh. gosh. I would rather have no friends than friends that don't care about me, so this rank means nothing to me at all. Looks like it doesn't matter anymore. The ranks are gone. It's gone? You were right, we don't need it. I can take your order when you're ready. Can I just get a number six? Of course. Is that all? Yeah. Uh, we give out a free dum-dum with each order. Thanks. Hey, what can I- Wait, weren't you here yesterday too? You remember me? I don't think I could forget. Let me guess, you want to get a number six. How did you know? I have no idea. It must have been <laughs> luck. And here's your dum-dum. Have a good day. Thank you. Oh, look, it's my favorite customer. Stop, you're making me blush. So, what's your name? If you don't mind that I'm asking. It's Bailey. I don't mind. My name's Lucas. You should try the number one instead. It's my favorite. You know what? Sure. Enjoy the dum-dum and have a good day. You too. I can help who's next. Oh, hi. Where's Lucas? He moved to a different location. He doesn't work here anymore. Um, do you think you could tell me the new location that he works at? No, I can't disclose that information. Sorry. Could you move if you don't mind? There's people in line behind you. Wait, but what about the free dum-dum with each order? I'm sorry, we don't do that here. I'm never going to be able to find him again. There's like 300 locations just in my area. Are you excited to start your new job today? Yes, I can't wait to meet everyone. You'll be amazing, don't worry. <laughs> Thanks. Hi everyone, welcome to your first day on the job. I'll give you guys a few minutes to get to know your co-workers. Um, excuse me, have we met before? I'm not sure, I don't think so. I'm sorry, it's just that you look really familiar for some reason. Maybe we met before or something. Well, anyway, my name is Bailey. I go by my middle name, Will. It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Okay, everybody, it's time to get started with the work day. See you later. Yeah, of course. Whoa, did you design that by yourself? Uh, yeah, I did. It's beautiful. You have a lot of talent. Thank you. I appreciate that. Now that I think of it, I definitely remember you from somewhere. I'm sure we'll figure it out at some point. Hopefully. This is going to bother me for the rest of the day. We were lucky enough today to get a catered lunch for every single one of you. <gasps> they have dum-dums! <laughs> Uh, Bailey, is something wrong? Lucas? 7-1? What, is my soulmate Bigfoot or something? Man's is like a walking skyscraper. My soulmate's only 5-4! Aw, short king. No, it's not cute. Why not? All of my kids are gonna be so short. <laughs> well, it's better than the ugly gene that you're gonna give them. I am not ugly! Um, who are you looking for? My soulmate. That's how you're gonna find him? You know, I don't think I could miss him. He is 7'1". That is so funny considering you're like 4'11", right? Okay, first of all, I'm 5'2". Thank you. Maybe he's like an NBA player. I really hope so. Bro, are you drinking from a salsa jar? 7'1's not like that tall, right? Are you dumb? That's really tall. <laughs> What's with all the commotion? Dude, there's a guy in the hall that literally looks like Slenderman. My soulmate! 
Excuse me, sorry, excuse me. I need to get through. We all want to talk to him. Wait your turn. He's definitely not going to talk to you when you look like Shrek. What? Shrek? <sighs> Bro, he's literally built like the Eiffel Tower. Well, how tall do you think he actually is? It's got to be over seven feet. Can y'all stop shoving me like this is the Hunger Games? It's a dude. Wow, wow, wow. These girls are going feral for him. I'm not going to be able to get to him. Um, I think I know how we can. How? Here, get onto my shoulders. <laughs> okay. Are you sure this is safe? Nope, not at all. Okay. Hey, moving skyscraper, wait up. Hey, Bailey, how's the weather up there? Shut up. Sir, hi, how tall are you? Um, 7'3". Ugh. What, do you have something against tall guys? Oh, I'm sorry. That just means that you're not my soulmate. How tall is your soulmate? 7'1". Oh, my brother, 7'1". A brother? So, where's your brother at? Um, I don't know. He didn't come with me. What do you mean you don't know? It's, like, urgent. Why do you care so much about where my brother is? Uh, hard to explain. You are so weird. I'm out. Uh, wait, please. Bro, no. You're freaking me out. Can you just leave me alone? Okay, I'm sorry. So, do you want to get down, or... Yes, I want to get off your shoulders. Whatever, he looked like a grasshopper, and his brother probably does, too. You're just mad he didn't like you. Do you think that the brother goes here, too? <laughs> Who knows, but he's 7-1. I'll see him. Yeah, but will he even see you? What do you mean? You're just, like, so much shorter than him. I've had enough of the short slander. This is so annoying. Oh, oh my god, there's two of them! Two of who? We need to get his attention, now. Throw something at him. Okay. Not a glass. Oh! Bro, are you kidding me? Which one of you just threw a glass at my head? Should we run? Um, I think so. Yeah, okay. You two, stop right there! So are you the one who threw mm -hmm. the glass? Guilty. You need to come with us to the office now. Damn, we got caught. There was like 12 witnesses. Thanks to you, he now has a concussion. He has a concussion? I just wanted to get his attention. So you throw the most dangerous thing you could find. It seemed like a better idea at the time. Wait, are you the girl who's been harassing my brother? Ah, uh, no, it wasn't me. Who else would have purple hair? Shit. Could you just tell me why you did it? Because I needed to talk to you. To me? About what? How tall is your soulmate? Um, I am not telling you that. Just tell me. It says 5'2". Wait, don't tell me you think that we're soulmates. Surprise! No way, you are not going to be my soulmate. What's that supposed to mean? You are obviously some kind of crazy. I don't like it. That is not true. I told you why I threw the glass. Yeah, but that doesn't justify it. Uh, well... I am so done with this game you're playing, I'm leaving. No, wait! So, um, I don't think he's gonna press charges. He didn't seem very concussed. That's the girl who threw the glass. <gasps> really? Why are y'all whispering about me when I'm right here? Oh, <laughs> sorry, I didn't know you could hear us. Of course I can hear you! It's just embarrassing that you were so desperate for attention. Whatever, it's also embarrassing that your hair looks like that. My hair is $3,000! <laughs> Um, I think that our plan may have backfired a little. Yeah, just like the smallest bit. I know he's my soulmate. I just need a new plan. What? It's not like you can go after his twin. Wait. No, do not tell me that. Hey, you. What? Are you going to throw a glass at my head, too? No. You're going to use me to get my brother. No, that's not what I'm doing at all. I promise. It's clear you're just desperate for a soulmate. No, I was trying to get your attention all along. I just thought you were really cute. Wait, really? Would you want to hang out with me? Yeah, yeah, love to. Here's my number. Thanks. That was, like, suspiciously easy. No, there's got to be a catch, right? There definitely is. He just said that I was harassing him, and he agrees that fast? I don't know. Maybe it's because you're cute. I know. Oh my gosh, what if he, like, murders you or something? Okay, let's not manifest that for me. Thanks. It should be one, four. Yep, this is it. Hey, uh, welcome in. <laughs> Hi. Both of you. Listen, we just have a few things to ask you. So, why are you such a whore? Excuse me? Uh, I'm just messing with you. That's not one of the questions. Okay, not funny, but go on. 
You need to tell me how tall your best friend is. She's 5'6". Why? Because my soulmate is 5'6", too. Don't tell me you think she's your soulmate. She might be if you're my brother's. I already said I don't want you as a soulmate. I don't want you either, Skyscraper. So, can you help me here? No. What? Why not? <laughs> I just don't want to. It's because she's a selfish bitch. Can he leave the room? Because he's really killing the vibes. Yeah, bro, get out of here. Listen, I'll help you get my best friend if you help me get your brother. Ah, okay, I guess I can help you. Fine. Deal. Just don't throw any more glasses at his head. I know, that was a one-time thing, I swear. Hmm, I have an idea. I need to go find my best friend. Can you convince your brother not to hate me? I will try my best. Okay, thanks. Bestie. Hey, what's up? I have some tea. Do you want to hear it? Um, yes, always. Do you know that kid who's 7'3"? How could I not? I heard he has a crush on you. Oh, I'm not interested. He's not really my type. What do you mean he's not your type? He's so tall. Yeah, but it's like a little too tall. Didn't you just call your soulmate a walking skyscraper? No, I love men that are two feet taller than me. Right. Just forget it, okay? I don't want him. Wait, please. I'll pay you. Wait, are you serious? <laughs> yeah. How much are we talking here? A thousand dollars. Oh, absolutely. I'll do whatever. Yay. Oh, I'm going to be dirt poor. This is so dumb. He's not my soulmate anyway. Mine's 5'9". Wait, what? Today's the day. You have to pick a job for the rest of your life. Can I be a princess? Sure, if that's an option. I'll be right back. Don't choose anything while I'm gone. Okay. Hey, little sis, what options did you get? I got billionaire and then janitor. You should pick janitor. They do really cool things. Oh, I'm definitely gonna do that. Sweetheart, what happened to your choices? Oh, I already picked one. How do you even make a bathroom this dirty? Bailey, come on now. You're being moved into a new house to clean. Oh, thank you. This is the house you'll be cleaning. That's a hotel. No, it's just a mansion. Hi, you must be our new maid. Wow, I didn't realize they could be so beautiful. <sighs> thank you. Excuse me, your wife is right here? I'm Richard and this is Carissa. You'll be living in and the pay is $1,000 an hour. Is that all right? Yeah, yeah, that's great. Could I talk to you separately? Of course. You better stay the fuck away from my man. I'm sorry, what? Stay away from my man or I'll stab you.